Peter Nagyar, this guy on the Nevermind Your Own YouTube channel with the continuation of the Titan Switch antenna test. In the previous flight, I did a quick test flying as far as I could, could get with the whip antennas. Now I'm going to use uh, the booster. In an earlier test, I had put the antennas on the booster and then put the cables into my car. And uh, the manufacturer advised me to put the booster right on the transmi transmitter and then the cables and then the antenna. He also said you might want to try the whip antennas instead of the directional because in many cases the whip antenna is just good enough and you don't have to point it exactly towards the drone all the time. It does make sense because, as I've said in an early in in one of these earlier videos before, with stock antennas I would be able to get five plus kilometers in ideal circumstances. Uh, with these whip antennas, I should be able to get a little bit more, and then with the booster even more. So six seven kilometers should be possible. So that's still like a goal for me to get six kilometers so that's what we're gonna try right now okay as you can see right now I have the whip antennas on top of a long tripod with the cables and then I got the, um, the booster on my transmitter and that should do the trick. All right, so. I got the extra capacity um, battery on it, so I might be able to do a little bit more. But the big test is um, to see how the signal will do. even at three kilometers because that was where I was getting into trouble. I don't have to worry about directing my transmitter right now. The antenna is a lot higher. I am in sports mode so I can, can, I can go relatively quick. And um, as you can see, it's five bars at 2.4 gigahertz, kind of automatically, which is good. Now I'm getting a bit of a signal lost, but just for a second, because I got five bars again. where I am still at 50 meters height. And four again, five again at 1900. Two thousand 
meters. It's going up and down. But I think it's pretty good. Maybe I want to fly a little bit into this direction because I see houses there. I just want to be out in the open. Two and a half. Maybe go up a little bit, maybe go to 60 meters. It's going pretty well. Maybe go high. You see, I'm at 70 meters, I'm five bars again. Wow, three kilometers, five bars. This is, uh, this is pretty awesome, actually. 80% battery. And I'm at 3.3. .3. I'm going to turn a little bit to this direction. I don't want to be too close to the water. I might want to cancel return to home if the battery is low because you guys have seen that I had 50% battery left. Turn a little bit to this side. If I get get into trouble, I want to have it to land in the meadows, not in the river. Okay, four kilometers. You, you can see I go up, and the bar goes up a little bit and back to one I'm in sports mode but you don't see propellers because I got a camera down so much so actually this is pretty good I'm going a lot faster than normal Okay, I'm at 120 meters. Maximum flight altitude reached. Yep, yep, yep. Four and a half kilometers. Wow, I'm at 70% battery. 4.78 kilometers but I got a little bit of wind in in the in the head how do you say that a little bit of tailwind so it definitely needs more to get back I'm at five kilometers and it's doing great one bar sometimes two bars so I think I should be able to get six kilometers like this. Are we going for it? Yes, we are going for it. That's what we're gonna try. Battery or not. I may have to walk to pick it up, but let's see. Level is I'm going to cancel the this. Will go to the home point in 10 seconds. 
all right because I'm gonna do six and then go back it's gonna be a record for me five eight five nine now I'm getting into trouble, you see that? Okay. Yeah, I got six, so I'm gonna return to home. Whoa. Like this, go home. And let's see if it will be able to make it. It's very dark cloud here. I think this is shorter. Go like this. And then I have to go to the other side. Also, I may want to fly a little bit lower. Because there might be less wind. Not too low. And I can already see the home I can before the remaining time. So it's gonna make it. Let's see if I'm still flying towards my home point. And the, the home icon is far before my flight time. So as you can see, I canceled return to home and that was no problem at all. And I've even got headwind right now. So this is going very well actually. Breaking a record, six kilometers, I could have even gotten further. This is the right setup. I even got cables. Without cables, the signal would even be better. I would even be able to go further, but with cables, I'm able to do this. So that's just awesome. That's, that's, yeah, that's fantastic. That's just great, man. And I, I did not even have directional antenna. It's just whip. It means I could fly like six kilometers all around. And still have signal. With the directional, you would even be able... You're just beyond your battery. So it means... I need to be looking for a battery mod. And you can see it's on the screen, it's drifting a little bit to the left. That's because of the wind. But that's okay. Um, because um, it means I will stay above the land and not above the river. And I don't know how these ships on the river do, but maybe they have Wi-Fi routers on their ships as well, and that might occasionally interfere with my signal. And and I got one plus kilometer to go, and I got 40% battery left, man. Meaning... I could have even flied, flown a little bit more. But you know, at six kilometers distance, how big is the risk <laughs> you want to take? I think I already did well. This is going to be my longest and furthest flight ever. Ever, ever, ever. This is breaking my own records again.
it will be more and more difficult to outperform this. Very good. Should be able to see it. Yep, there it is. You did very well. did very well. Congratulations, man. I hope you like my videos, experiments and all. And if so, you have to give this a thumbs up. I mean, give me one good reason why you wouldn't give this a thumbs up if you like the videos say so in the comments share it with friends and families and all that kind of stuff because this was an essential test it was an essential test and it means I'm ready for another big thing that was just Awesome! That was just awesome!